Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be setting up my budget for February, which I'm excited to um, be actually filming this um, video because if you guys didn't know, February is my birthday month. So I'm excited about that. So I have here all the stickers that I'm going to be using. If you guys are interested in any of these stickers, there are they are available in my Etsy shop. Um, the link will be down below for you guys to go check them out. And I'll be using this pen for the month of February. So let's go to our month here. And this is the calendar. I'm going to start with the calendar and then, you know, set up the calendar, the bills, and then set up my budget. This is the monthly kit for the month of February. So if you guys are interested... The link is down below so you guys can go check it out. So let's get started. And let's see. Oh my. It's stuck. <laughs> okay, so let me turn this. Let me close this so it can be more easier for me to put them. I've always said that laying down my stickers is just like the hardest thing ever. I am going to be able to see the, the days. So I'm going to wipe those out. I guess I should have learned by now. <laughs> I have to wipe these out. And so there's that. Okay. So now there you go. And then let's do the other side. There you go. So we'll use this strip right here. I guess I'll white out the line as well. Okay. So let's see if we do it right. that one a little bit higher than the other one yep a little bit that's okay i don't mind that i also add added one of these washi strip that goes at the bottom and then one for the other side and should i just cut it here I think I'll just cut it here. No, you know what? I'll just go all the way because I don't really use that little calendar anyways. So I'm going to probably cover it up. So now I'm going to be putting my day dots. And this is going to be long. So I'll just probably forward you guys through all of this. And I'll see you guys once I'm done. Okay, so I am done I kind of want to cover this up and I will be using one of these washies here. I'll probably use this one, the flower one. And I'm going to have to cut it. Okay. Um, okay, there you go. I kind of want to use that one for my... For my budget so I'll, i guess i'll just use this one and then i'll use the red i don't really mind the mismatch i just want to cover the numbers up from here okay so there you go. So I have here my Bill Do stickers. These are also available in my Etsy shop if you guys are interested. I have my paydays, my garbage, water, credit card, um, water. This is actually the electric. Internet. This is electric. I just this this was a misprint and I'm using it for myself. Internet car payment and my mortgage okay so i mean i'm going to be using all of these i 
have Hulu, my electric, electricity. So my Hulu before, before it used to be like on the first, I ended up changing that and now it's going to be on the 28th. So I am going to put my Hulu bill over here. I did end up changing that and I think it's going to be about $20. I'm not sure because I ended, I upgraded. So my electricity and my internet stay the same. That's on the first of the month. That is the internet and the electricity. And the internet is uh, $44.95. Okay, so there's that one. And electricity, I have one for electricity. Just have to change the, I'm not even paying attention to what I'm doing here. So this is the electric, electric bill. Should I just do it? No, I'm going to change it. I am just going to change it. I'm going to put this one over here. Perfect. I like it. <laughs> so no more electric, um, credit cards, water bill. And garbage i don't know if these are due this month i'm gonna have to check on that so paydays my husband uh recently lost his job so on paydays i'm not gonna even put in because we don't really know about that so how that how that's gonna work so uh we are i'm just not gonna use the paydays um he is doing like side jobs but we don't know when he's going to get paid. So as soon as he gets paid, I'll just update you guys on that and put it. So I'll put that to the side. I do have my mortgage here and my car payment. Wait, my car payment is $358.20. And that one is like at the very end of the month as well. The 28th. There you go. So car payment is done. And then I have my mortgage. My mortgage is also at the end of the month. So I'll put that at the end of the month. There you go. I'm gonna do my phones. The Fubo TV. So it's Wells Fargo. And that one is 101.24. That one is due on the 11. So there's that. My phones, my phone bill is due on the 10th. So it's on the 10th. And then I have Fubo TV, which is due on the 12th. And on the amount, I think it stays the same. Okay. And then for city, I don't even know. I'd have to check that as well. And that one is on the 17. I still have Chase. And that one, the same. I don't know the amount still. So I'll have to wait on that one as well. And that one is on the 25th, right? Let me check. Um, 24th. Um, there you go. Okay. So then I have my car payment and then Netflix and mortgage. Okay. So that is done. Then I have my car payment, Hulu, and then Netflix. And that one is, it changed. Did it change here? I don't know. I think it went up um, 1947. So it's 1947 for Netflix. 
That one's due on the 28th as well. I don't know. Should I just put it here? You know what? I'm just going to put it on the 27th. Just so it doesn't look out of place. I'm still going to... It's still, you know, direct deposit or direct payment. So there's that. I like it. I have some hearts here that I want to use for... for the month of February. Also, if you guys didn't know, February 16 is my birthday, so I might be having a sale on my Etsy shop, so stay tuned. I still don't know when to start it, so stay tuned for that. I'll let you guys know for sure. So this is how I set up my monthly view, my monthly calendar. And if we go to the next page, this is where I'm gonna set up my budget. So I am gonna use one of these washi here that I have for this month and I am gonna put it here okay so there you go that is the one I'm gonna use for February so um, let me pull this up I don't want to rip it okay come on come on okay there you go Came out to be a little bit more it's not as close together but it's okay I don't mind okay there you go okay so now I'm gonna use my thick thin washi here and I wanted to use this one um I don't want to leave too much of a space because I want to do a different setup than last month. So I want to try and see if I like it better than the other way. So um, I am going to start with um, electricity. Then I have internet, phones. I also have Wells Fargo. Cabela's, I have my city card, Fubo TV, ice storage, Chase, Netflix, Hulu, truck payment, my mortgage, sinking funds, and unbudgeted. I also added an extra debt payment, so I am going to add that. Groceries, gas, household, um, eating out and allowance so as you can see it took the entire page and i won't be able i probably won't be able to use the savings the total savings the estimated savings and the actual savings uh, but that's okay i'll probably add that to another page i'll let you guys know where I'll, i add it if i add it okay so let me do my lines before i start doing the amount for my electricity this month, I estimate $150 because last month it was um, $117.53. So I just went up a little bit higher just so in case it is higher, I'm covered. Um, for my internet... This is an um, fixed expense, so I like to round it up to 45. I know that that one is going to be 44.95 because that is a fixed expense. For my phones, I think I'm going to estimate um, 370. I don't know the exact amount just yet. Uh, for this Wells Fargo card, um, it is a fixed expense. So I know that one is going to be one. Um, I guess I'll just round it up. 102. And then I'll just put the actual amount, which is 101.24. 
My Cabela's is a fixed expense as well. I'm going to estimate $20. That one is 1988. This one I still don't know the amount. And you guys will know why later on in my debt up debt update video. For Fubo TV, I know it's 60. Oh my, I can't remember. I know it was 64.91. I'm just gonna go up to 65. And the actual was 64.91. For ice storage. I estimate $10, which is always going to be $9.99. Chase, um, I still don't know the amount on that one. My Netflix, I am going to budget $20. And that one is $19.47. Okay, Hulu, I am going to estimate $21. I still don't know the amount yet. I am just gonna have to wait for my truck payment. It's three fifty nine. The estimate I know because I know the amount because it is the fixed amount. So it's three fifty eight twenty. My estimate on my sinking funds estimate twelve hundred. Um. I don't estimate nothing for an, an extra payment. I don't like to go that high up. So I just go up to $50. And then for groceries, I budget $700 monthly. For gas, I did have to bump it up a little bit and I did go um, to, to $400. For household, I budget $200. And for eating out, I budget $200 as well. Uh, now for allowance, and this includes my husband and myself, one twenty-five. So it'd be fifty dollars for me and seventy-five dollars for my husband. Okay, so that would be how this setup would look like. I like it. I kind of like it because everything is just in one place. I mean, don't get me wrong. I like how January um, setup was. If you didn't check out that video, make sure you guys go check it out. Okay, I also uh, put this little uh, money icons here so you can decorate your um, your um, spread. <laughs> and this is how I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna put them here. This it, the green kind of brings it all together, I think. So. This is the February budget. This is the monthly spread. Let me move everything so you guys cannot see my mess around here. So this is how February spread looks like. And then this is how the February budget looks like. So let me know what you guys think. Do you guys like it? Do you guys not like it? Uh, give me your thoughts and if you do like it don't forget to give me a big thumbs up subscribe if you haven't done so already and i will see you guys in my next video bye mm -hmm.